We're back, and I'm with Mr. Wine Snob himself, Ted Henry. How are you doing? Very good, thank you. And you are no stranger to the Dustin Charity Wine Auction. No. Now, let's break it down for people. What is it about this event? I'm sure you go to so many. I mean, this is what you do, basically, uh, party for a living. No. We won't hold it against you, but <laughs> I am very envious. But what is it about this event that makes it so unique compared to all the other wine events that you've been to throughout the country? Sure, no, absolutely. This is totally, it's unlike anything else because of the people. You know, it's all about the people, and they're so passionate about the charity and the children and all the Emerald Coast area, and, and it's something about it. Um, I love working with them. We, we're friends. We're yeah. friends with everyone here, and you don't get that sort of interaction and, you know, the quality people in, in other parts of the country. So I love it. I look forward to this every year, and, uh, yeah, I hope to keep coming back. Yes, and we definitely are so glad you're back with us again. Talk about... Uh, your trip down here, obviously come from California, a little bit of different scenery. We have great weather. I don't know if you were here last year, if you can remember, it was absolutely pouring down rain, but the weather is cooperating this year. It's just beautiful. What a great time to be here. Right. We, uh, yeah, last year we did the dinner, the patron dinner on the beach in yeah. a massive thunderstorm and there's lightning and it was, it was, it was interesting. It worked out great, but um, yeah, this year, I mean, it's just been perfect weather. Uh, the trip, actually, all the travel was really good. Yeah. Um, got here on Wednesday and it was a little bit, a uh, little bit overcast and cloudy, and then it just turned into one of the best weekends ever. So, yeah. yeah, everything's been good. Yeah, we did have those storms on Wednesday, but it really did clear out for this weekend. Let's talk about the patron dinner. Where were you yeah. last night? Uh, Bait Shack, I think it is. Yeah. Um, we can't remember he drank too much. He's feeling awful right. today. No, I feel great. <laughs> Thank you. Um, no, we had a great, we had a great dinner. The guys um, from Little Palm Island out in, uh, by the Keys came yeah. out, did a great job with the food. We had Dread Clampett, um, yeah. local band play that was just, it was so fun to have a wine yeah. dinner with a really cool band. Everyone was dancing. It was, the whole thing was great. Did it with uh, Bill Neckow from Duckhorn. So we had Duckhorn and Jarvis in one dinner, and so we got a lot of different wines. Um, great people. The whole thing was, it was a huge success. So. Oh, fantastic, great. fantastic. And, I know you, of all people, I should ask, what goes into making a perfect glass of wine? Wow. Well, there's a, lot, there's a lot of factors, but it's really about the, the grape source. Everyone will tell you that. And what's kind of cool at Jarvis is we are an estate with just one little vineyard area that we own, and that's where all the wines are made from. So you always know a, a glass of Jarvis comes from that one little piece of land in Napa, and it's always going to have that similar quality to it. So yeah. that's what it's about. Well, there you have it from the expert himself. We hope you are all having a great time at the 6th Annual Dustin Charity Wine Auction. Just remember, all of your help here today is going for such a great cause. We'll be back in a minute.